Do you like dragons? Did you know there is one in the sky? His name is Draco. His tail wraps around the Little Dipper. He is not a particularly bright dragon, but he is very large. What is the story behind Draco? Do you know? There are actually several different stories. The one that I like the best is the one that says Draco was the dragon that guarded the golden apples that grew in Juno's garden. Juno was the Roman queen of the gods. She got these apples as a wedding present, and they were very special to her. She had some helpers called the Hesperides, and she asked them to watch the garden. She also asked Draco the dragon to help them keep guard over her apples. Hercules, whose constellation is also in the sky near Draco, was told to steal some of these apples as one of his twelve labors. We will find out more about the twelve labors of Hercules when we discuss his constellation. However, we do know that stealing the golden apples of Juno was one of Hercules' hardest labors. First he had to find the garden, which was very tricky. Then he had to kill the fierce dragon. After he did that, Juno was very sad that Draco was dead. She wanted to honor him, so she put him in the heavens in a very important space, right between the big and little dipper. You can see Draco in the sky from May to November. To find him, first look in your star chart. Locate the big and little dipper. Then you will see Draco's tail wrapped around the little dipper. His neck and head will be between the Little Dipper and Hercules. Once you've found Draco in your star chart, you can go outside and look for him in the sky. Now, let's take a few moments while we practice finding Draco.